hello friends welcome back to my channel again in this video we are going to learn about how to set up the port channel in Cisco ASI device if you are watching my channel very first time please don't forget to subscribe my channel so that uh, any new videos that I will post in the future it will get notified as a suggestion for you all right so over here I have uh, um, I am verifying my interface status by putting show interface IP brief So it's showing I have uh, gig 1 until gig 4 the interface status showing as app is it's because I have uh, I have uh, the cable already completed 66. cable already completed now I'm getting into the um, I want to uh, build a port channel between uh, 8, 3 and 4 first, right? So I'm going to copy this interface and getting into, after you enter into the interface, enter command channel group, just uh, number, give the number channel group number as whatever you want I'm just giving channel group 1 and then mode hit the channel mode I'm going to set it up this as a active all right all right um, after I I'm done with the port eighth number 3 I have to do this again for 8th 4 because I'm going to do the uh, port channel between 8th gig 8th uh, 3 and 4 channel group 1 mode active right so now these two ports are part of uh, one one port channel let's verify that show ip interface interface ip brief i have the port channel created let's verify show port channel 1 it shows as lacp active and let's also verify show run port channel show interface port channel 1 so here we are able to see members in this channel gig 3 and 4 and the status is active because I have the interfaces already turned up uh, meaning I have the cables are already connected all right so over here we need to um, see uh, one main thing clearly so when you configure the port channel if you wanted to set up the uh, mode as active meaning um, if you have LACP enabled the device link aggregation uh, then you might need to choose that for uh, as an active because the link aggregation control protocol will will automatically exchange the um, link aggregation with your, your device which is Cisco ASA else you are forcefully making that as on mode uh, which you are setting that as a static port channel so I set it up as active for the sake of, sake of uh, the peer device to detect this device unconditionally so it is based on your uh, environment setup okay so that's it guys uh, the port channel configurations are done uh, hereafter you can configure the port channel with the respective IP address for a uh, further specific zone security zone what you are going to create all right thank you guys